Hey everyone and welcome back to Cooking Tamad Style. I'm Julian and I am Trisha and welcome back to our segment. Nice to have you here. Yep, we're very glad that you guys have been supporting us all throughout this time and for today's cooking segment, we're going to be doing something a little bit different because Trisha and I have been talking and we've been saying, "Ah, we're always using uh, you know, the the stove. Why don't we use something else?" And so Trisha, what are we going to use today? We're going back to microwave recipes. Yay! All right. We're going to make easy egg breakfast recipes. That's right, guys. So we're going to be using our special ingredient today are eggs. You know, all almost 99% of households have eggs, right? And so if you're if you're going to be using eggs, you always use the, the stove, but now we're going to be using the microwave. So... Trisha, why don't you tell us what your ingredients are for your egg? All right. Thanks. Yes. So I am going to make quiche. Like halit. Quiche. quiche. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I'm making herbed quiche with spinach and cheese. So my ingredients, of course, I've got the egg over here. Some spinach that I tore into little pieces. Cheese. This is a mixture of Parmesan and cheddar cheese. And quiche always has some dairy in it. So I'm putting in some butter. This was melted butter and now it's solidified again. <laughs> and a splash of milk. And some seasonings, Italian seasoning to make it herby. Salt. And pepper. That's that. How about you, Julian? What are you making today? Well, that quiche really looks, sounds, you know, I think it's going to be really good. So, guys, for me and my egg recipe, I'm going to be making a frittata. Ta-da! <laughs> so, guys, frittatas sound really fancy, right, Trish? But then they're actually very simple to make. And you guys, you guys know me, I'm a very simple person, very tamad style. And so my ingredients are simple. I've just got my eggs and here I've cracked four eggs and I've already whisked that. So there you go, check that out. My four whisked eggs. Just like Trish, we're doing some melted butter. And so here I've got some melted butter with some salt in it already. And with a frittata, it's any vegetable that you want to mix in. You can put some ham, you can put bacon if you want. I'm doing mine without any meat. Um, so I'm just putting in some vegetables that I found left over in the fridge. So those are some leftover greens. I've got some garlic and pepper that I'm mixing in. And I am putting in some mushrooms as well for my frittata. So again, guys... Any greens or meat that you find, you know, you got leftover chicken, leftover bacon, put it in. So, guys, to make a frittata, and I'm going to go ahead and start making this because mine only has one simple step. And that step is mix it all together. That's right, guys. Mix it all together. You've got your eggs, right? And I'm going to be mixing that with the butter. I'm just going to make pour it all in over there. To make sure I get that good mix. And then I'm going to put in, you know, the garlic as well. So putting in that garlic and pepper. And mixing that as well as I could. And then once I've mixed all the wet ingredients, I'm going to be putting in my vegetables and mushrooms. So putting in those veggies. Right? Look at that. And those mushrooms. I'm going to mix it all. Oh, there's one more. I'm going to mix it all together, guys. And then I'm just going to chuck it in the microwave for around two minutes. And then I'm good to go. So, Trish, um, while I put this in the microwave, why don't you show um, everyone how you're going to be making that quiche? All right. So for my quiche, the method is nothing different from Julian's. I just need to mix everything together. So like Julian's, I am going to add the wet ingredients first. So I've already whisked my egg. There you go. While Julian was mixing his, just whisk it. Add a splash of milk. You can use any type of milk you want, or you can also use cream. 
want to make it a bit rich. And my melted butter here just mix it well together so all those ingredients get incorporated all right so all of my cheese in my egg mixture yummy later when we put this inside the microwave the cheese will melt gooey gooey add the spinach some of the italian herbs a dash of salt and pepper. Just mix it all together. And just like julienne, this will go inside the microwave for two minutes. Two to three minutes, depending if your microwave is on high or medium power. All right, this is what it looks like. And hopefully it gets cooked in two minutes. All right, I shall put this inside my microwave. Julian, how are you doing over there? All right, hey Trisha, so that quiche really looks good. I can feel it's gonna be good. So my frittata is ready in the microwave, cooking for uh, around, again guys, around two minutes. If you wanna make it longer, if you feel like it needs to be there a little bit longer, just add a few 30, uh, 30 seconds if you feel like it. But while waiting for um, the frittata and Trisha's quiche to cook, I figured we might as well check some of the comments and see if we got any questions from the viewers or any questions from you guys. So yeah, let's check it out. Um, all right, oh, we've got quite a few likes. Thanks guys, I appreciate the love. Hmm. All right, here, we've got a good one um, from Christian from Blacktown in Sydney. Hey, we've got some watchers and all the way in, um, all the way in Sydney. So. Hey guys, what's up? Thanks for tuning in. So uh, Christian's asking us, Trish, um, hey Kabayan, been watching you guys for some time. Ah, thanks for that. Question for you guys. If you are an item in the kitchen, what are you and why? If you are an item in the kitchen, what are you and why? Um, hmm. uh, so Trish, you want to answer that question first? Yes, very interesting question. Interesting, yeah. <laughs> yeah. If I were an item, I would be the refrigerator. Because mm, right. okay. I feel so cold and numb inside. <laughs> Very emo. <laughs> oh. you, then? What would you be then? Oh, Trish. <laughs> Trish, a very emo of you, huh? <laughs> so I wonder who the person will be that will thaw that will defrost you every month. <laughs> um, if I was um, an item in the kitchen, guys, actually, I'm going to be um, a microwave. Microwave, like the microwave, why? Why? Um, because when things get cold, uh, people look for me to make things a little bit hot. And the second reason is because, um, you know, Sanay na akong pinapaikot-ikot. Ooh! <laughs> 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 All right, so, <laughs> Christian, hopefully that answers your question. And I actually just uh, saw my um, frittata finish. So I'm gonna go and get, uh, I'm gonna go get it. Is your uh, quiche almost done, Trisha? Just give me a second here. I think mine is done already, but I'll wait for you to get your frittata first. So for- I'm here, I'm here. Okay. Oh, so fast. All right. Let's I've got my yeah, so while you get your quiche, guys, just a reminder, always make sure you've got protective equipment because you don't want to hold up. You know, it can get pretty hot in the microwave. So make sure you've got something to, you know, hold the plate with. So this is my ta -da, 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 ta -da. <laughs> and It smells really good. And I'm excited to, you know, get into this. Can we see your quiche? Gosh, look at that. Wait, wow, wait. that looks really good. Oh, if right? the yeah. go inside. Oh my. <laughs> look, the cheese oh is in Did you see that? As wow. usual, okay. goodbye. All right, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed our egg microwave um, episode today. Please, guys, as usual, 
as we near the end of the show, don't forget to like, leave a comment. If you guys want, send us some recipes that you guys want us to try out. And of course, don't don't forget to give us a shout out uh, whenever you can. Trisha. Again, like, follow, and subscribe to our socials. And we'll see you next time. We'll prepare something. Come on, Sal, again for you all. Thank you for joining us today. Bye.